Time now for Eyewitness News, Call 12 for Action. One of the top 10 complaints into our Call for Action Center are regarding elderly schemes. It's estimated that fraudsters take billions from seniors every year, and tonight consumer reporter Susan Hogan is offering ways for seniors to protect themselves. We hear from so many seniors who unfortunately call 12 for action after they've been victimized by a scheme, and by that time, their money is already gone. Dr. Al Cadenhead received a call last year from someone claiming to be with the IRS. Delay in calling us back might end up into a legal mess for you. She was informing me that uh, they were filing a warrant for my arrest. What Al didn't know, the caller was a scheme artist who demanded immediate payment for back taxes. So he sent her $16,000 through prepaid debit cards. I am very afraid at that point. Al is one of eight Eight seniors profiled in a new Consumer Reports article on the growing problem of senior fraud. The schemes range from fake sweepstakes to being duped by shady contractors and shady financial advisors. Well, seniors have retirement savings under their control, and scammers know that, and so they go after them. Consumer Reports says American seniors lose billions of dollars every year to fraudsters. There are ways that seniors can protect themselves. The most important thing is not to answer a phone call if the caller ID is from a number you don't recognize. It's also important to check contractors by searching their names on the Rhode Island Contractors Registration Board or through the Massachusetts Consumer Affairs Office. Also, check on a business with the Better Business Bureau to make sure they're legit. And seniors should always ask trusted family members for help. Letting a relative view your accounts on a regular basis for irregularities. Another thing you can do is buy a telemarketer call blocker that can keep potential con artists from getting through. And if you have a consumer problem you need help solving, contact our Call 12 for Action Center Monday through Thursday from 11 until 1. Hotline is 228-1850. Or if you're interested in becoming a Call 12 for Action volunteer with me, you can call that same number you see right there on your screen. I'm consumer reporter Susan Hogan, Eyewitness News.